Most likely, you've heard the name Steve Jobs related to the subject of Apple Computer. But did you know that there's a whole story behind Steve Jobs creating Pixar Film and even Nets Computer? Now before I really get into depth about Steve Jobs, let me give credit to one of the greatest inventors of all time, Steven Wozniak, for inventing the Apple One computer and helping Jobs to create one of the finest companies of all time. In order to fund Apple Computer, Steve Stefan Wozniak had to sell his HP calculator. Also, Jobs had to sell his Volkswagen van van to in order to fund the original Apple computer. I would also like to add that Apple was founded on April 1st, 1977. This is the Apple One computer. It was the first computer invented by Apple, invented by Steven Wozniak and Steve Jobs. When this computer came out, it was small, but impressed people by how, for how small it was in general. Also, only about 200 were made, making this a very rare computer. One was sold at an auction in 2012 for $374,500. The next thing that Steve Jobs set out to do was build the Apple II computer. The computer was built in 1977, but when it ended in 1993, 16 million units had been sold. This computer followed a closed architecture which allowed for other manufacturers to not be able to follow their mechanism. By the time the computer was done retailing, Apple had made an overall $12 million. Soon after the completion of the sales of the Apple II computer, Apple moved itself to California's Silicon Valley where it is still headquartered today. Jobs chose this location because of upcoming companies like Google and HP. In 1985, Jobs was fired by a fellow CEO and almost immediately founded Next. Once Next Computer was founded, Jobs shortly after left. Once Jobs had sold Next's computer, he moved on to a company named Pixar, which was purchased from Lucasfilm. He came out with several different movies, including Toy Story. Finding Nemo, and even The Incredibles. In 1994-1995, Jobs sold part of Pixar to Disney, making him their largest shareholder. In 1995, Jobs returned to his former position as CEO of Apple. When he returned, Apple was at the very verge of bankruptcy, but was soon saved by what we now know as Microsoft or Bill Gates. If Apple would have been shut down, Microsoft would have been known as Monopoly and would have been shut down itself. So Microsoft tended to buy a ton of stock from them and work as of that fear. Upon Jobs' return and out of the bankruptcy, Jobs came out with several devices such as the iPad, iPod Touch, MacBook Air, the iPhone 4S, iPhone 3, iPhone 2, and the iPhone original. On October 5th, 2011, the company Apple announced Steve Jobs' death. Steve will be missed by everyone and anyone in the technological industry. to express and show the amounts of best moments that Steve Jobs had throughout his life. Thank you Steve Jobs for, its, for helping out the technological world and shaping our world to what it is now.